fight! Hey guys, this is Versatile from VSC Power, now hosting Project for the Community. Today's PS3 game tutorial, we're going to show you how to make a copy of your game to your external, or maybe you want to do an internal hard drive using Multiman. So let's go ahead to the game section, let's go all the way down to Multiman, and at the time this recording, I'm using the 46606 Multiman version. All right, sweet, we're in. So all you gotta do is just go to the game section here, go to your game disc. So here is my Battlefield Bad Company 2 for today's example. Press square on your game controller. Now press X on the copy. And then it's gonna ask you, where do you want to copy it to? So press down, go to USB zero, for example. And it's say, do you want to copy the game from BD-ROM to external USB triple zero? Say yes. And then it is going to go ahead and verify the data and then start copying. So what I'm going to do is this is going to take about um, 40 minutes, 30 minutes, something like that. So I'm going to pause the video and we will resume. See you guys soon. All right, so we're back. It took about 24 minutes and 33 seconds, a little bit shorter than I thought. So I'm going to press square on my controller to continue. And to show you proof that this does work, I'm going to go ahead and just eject my PlayStation 3 disc. All right, so the disc is ejected, but if we go back to the TV here, we'll see that if I scroll down, actually, let me scroll back up. <clears throat> we see that, I know it's hard to see, but it actually says uh, USB right here. So we can clearly see that the game is installed to my external hard drive, USB. So let's go ahead and just run the game and show you real quick what that game performance looks like. So it's going to go ahead, verify the data. Alright, sorry about that. I had to edit some of that verifying data. It took a little bit longer than I anticipated. But once you have selected your games and go back to the XMB screen here, then you just go up and you have your game disk loaded or mounted, so to speak. You run it and then now your game should start and we're ready to have a lot of good times here. Alright, cool. So it's actually working. So that is how you rip your games, like I said, you could do it to your external hard drive, but it has to be FAT32 format, or you can go ahead and rip it to your internal hard drive. Just make sure you got you know, enough space for that, basically. So that is today's video game tutorial. If you guys have any nitpicky questions, leave a comment here on the YouTube page, and I'll get back to you as soon as possible. Once again, thank you for watching. Take care. Bye.